Hi y'all, this is Deidre here with Deidre's Daily Dreamer coming at you with another video. Today is going to be a story time video. So, recently I decided I wanted to try out recipes, cooking recipes. I decided that, you know, I was just getting tired of the same things that me and my fiance have. And so I thought... I'll try some recipes. And so me and my fiance talked and he said, you know, um, babe, why don't you do one every other week so it doesn't stress you out and you can just, you know, get the food you need to make us a recipe and do it or whatever. So I looked at a couple different things and so I decided I wanted to try red beans and rice. Now, I've had red beans and rice as a little girl, and we normally made them out of, like, the little box concoctions that you get, which is fine, but I wanted to try a recipe, and I had all the stuff at my house except for, like, an onion, and I got, like, some seasoning that I needed, some Worcestershire sauce and some chili powder, which I had chili powder, but, so, I, like, Follow this recipe to a T. It's a crock pot recipe. And I thought, you cannot go wrong with a crock pot recipe, right? Wrong. Y'all, I was so devastated. I, I was, in the end, let's put it that way. But in the beginning, I was so proud of myself. I cut the onion. It was so pretty. And I um, followed the recipe to a T. Like, didn't miss any point to the, make sure I stirred it real good, everything. So, I was cooking dinner and I was making the next nights in the crock pot. Because the crock pot, you know, it's going to take, it said it was going to take six hours. So, I was like, okay. So... The next morning comes around, and I open the crock pot. It smelled awful. We don't know what happened to the recipe. We do not know what spoiled in the recipe. We don't know if it was too hot and overnight it cooled down too fast. We do not know what caused it to uh, go bad. But it reeked my house for like two days. My fiance got rid of it the next day for me because it was just like full. The crock pot was full too. I was like, and here in the South, you are raised to clean your plate. I was devastated. A whole crock pot of food I'm having to throw in the, the dumpster because... It miscooked. And so, that's my story. But I was so proud of myself. And then until I wasn't. Because the recipe failed so miserably. I will have to try red beans and rice again. But it's going to have to be jambalaya. I mean, uh, uh, what is it? Radermans? Radermans? Redamans, I'm not saying it right. It's Redamans, being the right. It's like a Louisiana brand, box brand you can buy. And I'm like, we're going to have to do that next time and just add the smoked sauces to it. Because we just ain't going to have a mess like that anymore. <laughs> but so that was my story. But I am, um, doing recipes so my next recipe i want to do is called guinness's like the beer uh beef and mushroom pot pies so i am eager to try that so i think i'm going to do that one next so it won't be this week it'll be the next week so Y'all wish me luck, <laughs> and hopefully I won't have a big mess in my kitchen trying to figure out this recipe, but it seems easy enough 
um it's just the crust is the issue but um Matthew's mom before she passed she showed me how to make a crust for an apple pie so it was not hard at all so and it did not make a mess or anything so I think I'm good to go so y'all I'm gonna be adding these segments on my uh, channel so if y'all like this and if you like this video and like me and my content also I am doing a weight loss uh, video series of my weight loss journey to lose 200 and something pounds so if you would like to see that and like to see more of me please click like and subscribe and as always dream big daily dreamers dream big